I told my dad last week that I'm planning on using the drain weasel method to remove the foam from my old dream station. Not so I can use it, mind you. Um, I have a hypothesis, though. I think the foam in these machines has as much to do with breaking up turbulence as it is sound abatement. And that's something I'm planning on putting to the test. Scientifically, if you will. Anyway, uh, when my dad uh, heard about that, he was like, well, will you take the foam out of my dream station so I can use it as a backup? Uh, my dad has Medicare, so um, they actually replaced his dream station, his recall dream station, with a new AirSense 10. But still, always nice to have a backup. Um, at any rate, though, things didn't go quite as I planned. And you'll see why here. We need to get this foam out of here. This is a relatively new machine. My dad got this machine in 2020, and he had only had it for about a year. Oh no. He had only had it for about a year when the recall was announced. God, if you look at that, that foam is falling apart. So anyway, with this drain weasel method, what you do is just slowly wrap that foam up in this drain weasel and pull it out. God, the foam is disintegrated to the point where it's hard for me to wrap the drain weasel around it. Oh God, this is not good. My dad has been breathing this crap in for over a year. It's really, really disappointing. I was only on the dream station from you know February till June when the recall was announced. My dad has been using a dream station since it first came out. So he's got many, many years of use. This is his second dream station. I also have his first one, and um, you know, I guess we'll see. But I don't even know if I'm going to be able to get this foam out. Oh God! God, that's really, really, really disconcerting. Sorry about the cut there. Um, I got really upset, to be honest with you. I thought I was going to be defoaming my dad's dream station so he could use it. And this is, this is what it looks like. This is what the foam in his dream station has turned into. I, I, I can't even really get it out of there, you know? I mean, I'll show you another attempt, but, you know, the point is you want that, you want the dream weasel, the, the drain weasel to, to wrap around that foam. And it's just so utterly disintegrated. There's nothing to wrap around. I mean, there's just, there's no, there's no solidity to it whatsoever. So, uh, yeah, I guess we all this a failed experiment. This is really upsetting. I've actually managed to get the foam out of this side. And you can see. consistency of it. It's, it's a little better than the other side. I'm not sure why, but it's still just disgusting, oily, crumbly goop. I guess maybe I'll take another pass at that side and see what I can do. I'm not sure 
how effective I'll be, but let's see. My dad was breathing that for a year. I think I've done as much as I can do with the drain weasel. Maybe I'll try to wash it out. I don't know. Don't know how effective it's going to be, but... Oh, oh God. Kind of just coming out. I shake it and slam it. Oh, God, this is disgusting.